Israelis are ever on the lookout for the next country to jump into the Abraham Accords, and eyes are now being cast here, all the way to the Indian Ocean islands of Comoros. With some Israeli outlets reporting the Israeli government is in advanced normalization talks with Comoros. The reports show the eagerness in Israel for more normalization, even with a tiny, poor, faraway country. The Comoros has unfortunately lived through difficult times, but we've decided to turn the page. We need to improve the lives of the population because all the problems are linked to economic precariousness. Comoros is a country of three islands near Madagascar and continental Africa, an outpost of Islam, where the local language has strong Arabic roots, which has even entitled Comoros to membership in the Arab League and a country that gets lots and lots of aid money from Saudi Arabia and the UAE. If Comoros normalizes, that could be a reason why. Comoros is also a former French colony, which still has strong links to Paris. We all now have people who are suffering from the situation, the imbalances in the health situation, the lack of economic development, the security and humanitarian situation, and we must provide a concrete response. Comoros has seen intense political turmoil. Coups, attempted coups, splits among its three islands. It is also poor. The kind of country where Israel, the UAE and the US might hope the Abraham Accords could yield real dividends as Israel and its friends look for diplomatic breakthroughs, both large and small.